bulk media. $74.99 delivered for 50 kilos of clothing. Apparently it's going to be B grade. There may be one or two which may have damage to it or, or markings that won't be washed out. So let's open up a box and see what's inside. So there's two boxes that arrived. Each box is approximately 25 kilos of clothing. Now I only got this because they're doing a Facebook ad campaign with Kieran's face on it. And I thought, well, why not? So let's just get into it and see what the score is. Well, first up, I can see George, which is just a bog standard. That's the bit of clothing. Right. Okay. And I said, what, what size is that? That's white, extra small. I'm going to hazard a guess that that's not going to come out as white. Okay, we'll move on, we'll move on. George, nice uh, plain t-shirt. What size is it going to be? It is UK 18, at least that's a, a sellable size. F and F. Look at this rate, it looks like one of my local charity shops. It's gonna get a load of donations for, uh... oh, it's reduced stock. Oh, was £3.50, now £1.50. Bernardo's rejected stock from Primark. Oh man. Adidas shorts. Oh, they're, uh, they're Leeds. Byro. So is that two so far? Hang on, I'm going to make a little pile of things that are marked or things that, that's marked. I bet it says Marks and Spencers. Oh no, Balsamic. So this was in a charity shop for four pounds, reduced to one pound fifty. And is uh, any severe bobbling on it at all? Although it doesn't feel particularly great, to be fair. What is it? Linen. But that does definitely had staining on it, so that goes in the terrible pile. This again looks tiny. Size 14. That looks like a stain down there. Looks like that might be paint just there. Do if you can see that. So that's going to go in the bad pile. What is this? Unbranded medium or it looks like it might be not a religious garment but something that would be used for that sort of purpose yeah I'll be honest Pep and Co as it stands I'm really not impressed but I suppose what I need is like two or three items that make it worth it this is, oh, George, lovely. I'm really gonna sell that for loads of money. Nutmeg. Jesus Christ, that is a better size. That's toddler. That has got to be toddler. Three to four years. There you go, spot on. I'll put that to one side. Ah, Pep and Co, 14. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what I was expecting to be fair, but Planum auctions. So that's someone's workwear. I thought that was someone's boxes for a moment then. So we've got like a sports bra, sports top. Yeah, that's all right. Oh, it is like most mostly just. Uh, it is just mostly crap. 10 to 11. What is that? Ladies hanging, £1.50. Again, again, it's just rejected stock. What is this? It looks like a horrendous dishcloth. Moda, George. 
George. Okay, class. All right, there might be something in that. Probably not. I mean, it... <sighs> Next, nope. Primark, nope. Ooh! Joy de Verve, de, yeah, de Verve, de Verve. JDV, I mean, they're all right. Have everything so far. <laughs> Probably one of the best items. Uh, oh, okay. Didn't. I'm gonna have to wash my hands. <laughs> Lovely jubbly. What is this? Peter Storm. That's not too bad, I suppose. Is there any obvious markings on it? Doesn't look like there is. Okay, that's into the not completely crap pile. Uh, what's this one? Esmara. Just feels crap to be fair. Divide. Yeah. Those are some big ass shorts, man. With buttons down the front. Yeah. Oh, looks like a disc, uh, like one of the placemats. Was it unbranded? It looks to be unbranded. Nope. George, nope. Johnny, nope. Oh, what is this? Pumpkin patch. Oh, it stinks. Oh, that smells. I mean, it's for a child, but it smells like it's been worn by an old man. And you can see there's staining there, staining there. That's on the stained pile. Pair of trousers, principles. Blue Harbour. Well, we've had like two okay items so naturally we need to get back to the bad ones new look next marks and spencers we need, oh that's cute that's very cute i'll set that to one side as well and that's also cute sweet I know loads of people having kids, so this will be reused. Primark, crap. What is this? Smile, Primark. Uh, what age is that? 98 centimetres. Jesus Christ, that's what Isabella is now. She's just over a metre. We've got some of a boy who might like that uh more boys clothing crap from primark lovely what's this stay wet six pounds Ooh. oh winnie the pooh put that to one side give that to someone in the ct group hey 24 to 24 to 36 months two to three yeah two to three Oh, they might be too small now, actually. Although saying that, he is shorter than Isabella. It might get some use out of it, don't know. Oh, I feel a tag. Is it brand new with tags? No, it's just a sense tag. Pep and Co. Uh, Union Blues. Lift and shape, new look, outlaws. Uh, 
some like motocross doing next. Yeah. Los Angeles. Atmosphere. This is so, oh, oh there's a football top. Oh, and it's a, it's a cracker. It's Wakefield. Oh, 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 oh. I'm taking a piss, by the way. I mean, oh, is that another mark? I'm going to presume that will come off. It looks like just cobwebs, to be fair. Okay. That's in the salvageable pile. What is this? Boohoo, it's brand new with the tags. Multi-dress, boohoo. Okay, that's, that's sellable. I'm branded. Con Contato, nope. I'll, obviously I'm gonna go back through the note pile again. Reebok. These look retro. Size 16, they're, they're, they can stay. Quit playing. Yacht with your dinghy. No. No. Oh, these are horrendous. Crivet. Where's the horrible writing down the side? Oh, what's that? Oh, there's something inside. What's it gonna be? Oh, it's, it's a bottle opener. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. And like a saw, that's like a surfing chindig type thing, isn't it? Uh, George, crap. Union Blues, crap. Monsoon, brand new with the tags. Retailed at 70 pounds. Not crap. <laughs> okay, well this is taking up a lot of room. Please be a good brand, please be a good brand. Premium Man, 1XL. Crap. Sock. Where's Dobby when you need him? And then, what is this? Lee Cooper. It's nine to ten years though. Still, that's probably worth putting to one side. This feels horrendous. That's just a rubbish football top. Primark. Crap. Kids, uh, five to six years. Farah. Okay, that's a nice surprise. That is a nice surprise. It looks to be, it looks to be all right. A bit of bending from where the. Uh, where uh, that is what's the ends like. That's not bad. Give me the other leg. You know what? That's a nice little surprise. Farrah jeans, I'll take that. Poor patrol. What uh six years. Don't really want that. I don't know. Oh no, jump it up there. And then what on earth is this? It's a robot. By George. Oh no, H and M. Bit of variety. Um, so so far we've got four items which are marked. The rest of them are all right. Well, I say all right. This is all the bulk which I don't quite know what I'm going to do with yet. It can just go back in the bloody box. Time for box number two. So box number one was all right. There was a few bits in there, which I'm not going to shout home about. 
but it it is what it is. It says until I suppose it's bulk. All right. Now you see this has got staining on it from heavy use. A bit sweaty. Please don't be a good brand. Regatta. Mm. Okay, I'll stick it in a washing machine. See what we can do with it. But that definitely looks a little bit oily there. We'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. Next up is a shirt. Marks and Spencer's Oxford Weave. I'll take that out as well. Oh, thermo fleece. Something in here stinks, man. <sighs> Premier man. It's just honking F and F crap. Blue Harbour. Guess what? Crap. Atmosphere. Crap. Atmosphere. Crap. Next, tailoring. Is that unbranded? No idea. Can't be asked. Two. Uh, so it's a swimming costume. Feels like a weird. Yeah, it's a swimming costume. Where's the brand? I can't find you anywhere. You're going to be at the bottom, aren't you? Down to sides. F and F crap. George. Oh, I can see Lee Cooper. In the corner of my eye. I'll get it in a minute. I will get it in a minute. What's that? Is that F and F? Or two? There. Rubbish. It's going to be the same again, isn't it? Yep. All right, this is the Lee Cooper. Those are... I'll take them. I'll take them. Oh, they're very soft. I thought they were going to be denim, but they're not. Okay, they're cool. We'll have them. Marks and Spencer's collection. No, thank you. What's this? Adidas. Is it actually going to be Adidas? It is Adidas. Ages four to six. 2019. Uh, we'll stick them in the to sort pile. Next. Miss Evie, no thank you, that's going with that. Boo hoo, no thank you. George. St. Michael? I mean, I've, I've passed up on St. Michael numerous times. I know some people bang on about how good it is. A lot of vintage Marks and Spencer stuff, so maybe uh, main, I might give that well as well. This is quite nice to the touch. Pep and go, still a no. Size 18. Don't know what you are though. You are polyester, but a brand, don't know. Oh, there's something here from Next, brand new with the tags. Where are you? It is size 18. The price is gone. Um, yeah. And the other thing is, I think a lot of these are going to be like less than a fiver. Dorothy Perkins. I think of what I might do actually. Moda by George. For fuck's sake. I don't even know why. I already know it's going to be rubbish. Response, what's that? Adidas. Climber call. And that is 2009. Doesn't. Uh, a bit of discoloration. Oh, there's damage. There's damage to it. That's annoying. I'm not even checking every single one. 
nutmeg nutmeg I mean I have to admit yes there's been a, a couple of nice bits but as I've heard in previous of watching other people do um, this sort of bundle there, there is a lot of crap there is a lot so I, just, I think a lot of it is even going to, uh, going to be going to some sort of a charity shop for Ben Sherman it's got a stain on the collar there it looks like it might be blood I think main I should probably look into that more yeah it's going to be going either to a charity shop or to some sort of a, not a food bank but do you know what I mean? Something where it actually goes directly to someone, Marks and Spencers, um, directly to someone free of charge, rather than Cedarbridge Estate to a charity shop, if you know what I mean. So it actually gets to the people that need it. And these are what unbranded. And they can they can go. This big jacket down here. Oh, it looks horrific. And it is. Select. No idea what that's for. Or from. I'm waiting for my wife to walk in the door at any moment. She's uh, she's just doing bedtime with the little one. M&S collection. Oh no, I can hear him upstairs. He's having a little bit of a tantrum. Oh, this is this is alright. What's this? Reebok Large. That's alright. Don't know where you can see that, because at the moment you're on my backpack. There we go. I'll take that. Marks and Spencers. But I'll do this again. I genuinely don't know at this point. Wins more. Never heard of it. Opt user. No, thank you. Oh, this, is this a football? No, it's not. It's a Max Athlete. Martin House. Children's Hospice. That's for some sort of a marathon. Oh, please be good. I mean, £75 I've paid. £75. It's all right. I mean, in theory, yeah, you could probably go to the car boot and you can sell all of like the quote unquote cheap stuff. Zara. Um, for like maybe a pound or two each. Gap fit. They're quite loud. They might be worth a shout. So, yeah, I mean, if, if you was a car booter, like a seller, this, this as well as reselling on eBay and Depop and everything else, Marks and Spencers, um, then yeah, this would probably be worth it because you've got stock for days. These are groovy three to four years oh you know what i reckon is a better would absolutely love that i'm going to stick that underneath the christmas tree what is this uh a... avenue no thank you what's that f and f at the bottom there yep don't want that oh what that's bright man oh miss selfridge I mean, it's vile, and there's a great big stain on it. Oh no, it's just glue from a from tape. Uh, I'll take it. Last three items. Let's have a butcher's. We've got. Never stop dreaming. What size is that? Five to six years. Don't really want to start keeping things for years when it comes to the little and. Loft's already full of crap as it is. Primark, no. 
And the last item is Marks and Spencers. Right, I'll throw all this back in the box and I'll show you my probably going to be selling on eBay pile. Okay, I must warn you, the pile you're about to see is this going to be thrown on the floor. So we've got a Miss Selfridge skirt. Is that a mini skirt? Let's put it up against myself. It's quite mini, I suppose. It's, it's above the knee. No idea what that's going to be worth. We've got a pair of rather loud train, uh, what are they, Gap? Yeah, Gap Fit. Like okay, exercise trousers. Reebok large t-shirt. Probably end up selling that as well. That'd be all right. Uh, main trousers. Oh, hang on. Is that just a cobweb? Oh no, it's someone's hair. Even worse. <laughs> uh, brand new tags. Uh, next dress. There. Main shirt. Marks and Spencer's. It's like a. Uh, that looks like that might actually be a pajama top, which might prove difficult to sell <laughs> without the trousers. Adidas trackies, Lee Cooper shorts, St. Michael's Oxford weave shirt, regatta coat with some wear and tear marks around the sleeve on both the arms. Uh, Farrah jeans, they were a nice surprise, but those are the sort of things you can buy in TK Maxx, brand new with the tags, unfortunately. We've got a five to six year old Barcelona shirt. A, I think it says nine to 10, Lee Cooper. It was nine to 10. Oh, look at me, I remembered. What's this? Artisan Monsoon. Brand new with the tags, retailed at 70 quid. Machine wash washable, that's quite quite handy. But yeah, that's not bad. Some nice retro looking Reebok trousers. It's gone quiet upstairs. Brand new with the tags, Boohoo. Dress size. 16, very loud. I don't even know why I put this on the pile. Uh, a Wakefield football shirt. I, I'm laughing at it. It's, it could well be the most expensive item on here. Just Do It t-shirt, Nike T, uh, six to 10 years. Oh, and then, we've got, oh, and then the rest of this bit... Oh, no, hang on, there's some more bits. The rest of it is just kids' clothes. Uh, Joy de Verve jeans. That's kids' clothes. You don't want to really want to see that. Primark, that's just kids' clothes. Oh, I've just been it. I don't even know why I'm thinking of, of the family I'm thinking of because oh, they, they've got loads of clothes. It's, they've got absolutely tons of it. Why am I putting aside Primark clothes for a child who it's going to fit for about three days before he goes out of it but that is really cute and i do like that i'm going to keep that because you never know and and that's cute as well god damn it what's this one pit storm that's quite nice looks to be in okay condition my phone is buzzing like mad my wife might be on the uh at the side of the door waiting to come in and that as well Put that to one side. So uh, as far as a pile goes of what is potentially resellable on eBay, it's not that bad. But I think these sorts of boxes, as I say, it's great for someone who not only sells online, but sells at a car boot as well. I've just realized with that regatta, it's all damaged there. So that's another one for the damaged pile. <sighs> that's annoying. There's probably about eight items that were damaged on first inspection. There could be more if I was to go through it again. But there we go, all done. I'll catch you guys soon.